Now, that is dark. What you're watching there is high definition dark. It's about as dark as dark can be. And this is what it's like if you're an Om. Now, if you turn the lights on, please, I'm getting a bit freaked out. There we are. Now, if you're an Om, you have to deal with that kind of darkness. Eyes are no good for you down here in the cave. The reduction of the eyes is a sort of disuse thing. They're in completely dark conditions, so they've no real need for the eyes. The Om's got a very broad head, which gives a larger surface area for the sense organs. So it, when it moves through its environment, it's faced with all the sensory clues in its environment. They can sense chemicals. A lot of that will be sort of in the mouth, so they've got an excellent sense of taste. So they can sense electrical fields around them. They have mechanoreceptors, which means they can sense vibrations in the water. They can hear as well, which is quite remarkable because they don't seem to have any external ear opening. Salamanders don't. They're brilliantly adapted to their environment. It really is a phenomenal little creature, and it has to be to survive in this phenomenally inhospitable environment. <laughs>